Hi there, I'm Scott Van Pelt. Welcome to Sports Center. Now we're going to get to the biggest highlights of the day and some blockbuster contract news. But we've got to start with the best thing I saw today, and that is what two Irish football players claim to have seen the ghost of George Giff. That's right. George Giff of Newt Rockney's Win One for the Gipper fame was spotted at Notre Dame's old campus theater, Washington Hall. Boy, am I glad I'm retired. Just like terrible timing. I know. Of course, the final and infinite judgment of God happens the one semester I actually like my roommates. Why do you think the Gipps ghost is so restless? Well, if I was stuck in this place for over a century and still didn't have tenure, I'd be haunting folks too. No, no, your son is perfectly safe here. It's only one ghost. USC? Are you sure? I hear that place is chock full of werewolves. Hello? Be reasonable. Paranormal activity is no reason to cancel a football game. Think of the ratings. They'll be huge. We're going to be a ghost of a school if this thing continues. Nobody's doing any work. It's Gipper, 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 24-7. George Gipp died in 1920. He was killed by leprechauns at Notre Dame. So now the school is calling in the Mannings, Peyton and Eli, to bust the ghosts, I, I guess. As kids, Peyton and Eli shared a bathroom, so they're used to crossing streams. So 